All right, y'all. I am back in New York City for another fun week uh, at work up here. See some client stuff, yay. So anyway, uh, I just got in. It's uh, 12.50 in the morning here. Uh, actually, the plane landed at 11, which was nice. And uh, I mean, I, I didn't check any bags. So, you know, I walked right out to the uh, the taxi stand, except they were literally, I'm not, I'm not even exaggerating. I should have filmed it, I guess, just to prove it. There were literally like 500 people in line at the taxi stand. It snaked like three times in very long directions and everybody was just waiting. And it, 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 so it turns out, and not, not <laughs> like it's fine, but like it turns out, so the Gay Pride Festival is going on today in New York. And so all the uh, cabs are doing all their business downtown and not out at LaGuardia, so. Anyway, so we just all waited kind of patiently as they kind of trickled in and finally I got my ride and uh, you know, then it's, of course, luckily, since it's like 12.30 at night, there's basically no one on the road, so we got here pretty quick. Anyway, this is the apartment that I'm in. For those of you who watched it last time, this one will look a little similar. It's a slightly different part. So uh, my company owns a, a like a townhouse out here in Central Park West. And so they have like uh, about, I don't know, a dozen apartments in the place. So this is one of them. As you can tell, it's similar decor if you were there last time. What's up? And uh, just in general, it's a... It's got this really nice, like, kind of natural brick lay. They've got that going on at the office, too, so that's kind of cool. What's this? Ooh, palm reading. Seven typical forms of the hand. All right, what do you guys got? Heart line, headline. I'll have to study this and guys give you some feedback later on my, uh, my line readings. Anyway, so this is the apartment. It's pretty slick. It's nice. I like it a lot. I mean, it's actually a really nice part of town and a lot of good stuff nearby. I'm like right next to the Museum of Natural History, basically. So yeah, but it is almost one o'clock in the morning, so I will be turning into bed. So anyway, uh, I will maybe give you guys a slightly longer tour later, but right now I'm checking, turning in, going to, going to sleep so I can get up early and catch the subway in. It's fun. Like. New York is a great place to visit for one week in one week increments, so I'm excited. But uh, you know, Courtney is already already uh, kind of sending me text messages, basically like saying like I'm coping, <laughs> which which you know that makes you always feel good about abandoning your family right in the middle of just summer and business and all that stuff and two year olds. I mean, God Almighty. So anyway, uh, I will talk to y'all tomorrow, and hopefully we have a good week. Okay, y'all, so I'm on my lunch break. I work at uh, a place called Italy. Italy. And it's actually a huge kind of open market slash restaurant slash cooking school. Like, and obviously it's all Italian or Italian based. Tell corner right over there. It's fun. Anyway, this place is just really like fun. So I didn't know exactly what I was walking into. I thought it was more of a dive bar kind of spot. It turned out it, was, it had multitudes. I'm gonna go wait. I ordered a calamari, so hopefully the food's as good as the, the place looks. So. so if you guys don't like calamari, it's not gonna appeal to you, but this is delicious calamari. Oh, I need to fix my. It's gone. Is that good? It is delicious. It's worth taking a picture of. So highly recommended. If you love books, you owe it to yourself in New York to come visit the Strand. They have so many books. And they're mostly used in the antique books and they're in pretty good shape. I'm trying to be quiet like a library. It's just really big. They, they claim they have 18 miles worth of books in here. That's about right. And just kind of all different categories and it just goes on and on. It's a good place to kill 45 minutes. I'm done with work today. I decided to come down and 
crappy book. So we new stop in New York, Nevada. It's a walk through Times Square. It's almost fun to people watch and get the crowd going. So. So those of you who've never been, it's really freaking tall. I think that's the thing I take away from it the most. I feel like a little person. I'm actually looking for a shirt store. Outside my apartment. We'll see if we can find something here. I might have to head over to Fifth Avenue or something. But there's some pretty good retail in here. Everything you could want, I'm sure. Hey guys, so I didn't film an end to my New York trip. I'd been there before and I kind of just like left off without kind of closing it out. But uh, so I'm back. Uh, it was a really fun week, but apparently it was really kind of lousy week for Courtney leaving here. So I'm sorry, Courtney, vicariously, but it was a lot of fun going to New York. I hope you guys enjoyed uh, watching uh, my week there. Uh, I know I enjoyed like just kind of roaming around the town, just having a good time. And uh, we're looking forward to all the rest of the travel we're doing the rest of this year. So thanks a lot guys for watching. Take care. Bye.